Hello and welcome back to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa Channel 408. So we have a second segment and it's not going to be just discussing other celebrities. It's the hot topic of the day, which is can five friends remain close to five close for five years? Everybody wants a good friend, just like everyone wants to be loved. But the reality is that many are not opportune to have such people. However, there are a lucky few who are blessed with the angelic with this angelic gift of either finding someone to be friends with them or they're their good friends in somebody else's life. And once you find that, it is something that you want to hold on to. It's not every time love affairs. So let me bring it to the table and give some light to platonic relationships. I think it's something that sometimes we sleep on a lot. We, we, we focus on being paired with someone and, you know, being somebody's babe. But, you know, friendship and stuff is really slept on. I want to ask you guys now, has there been any, any will I say a... A big moment where you felt like without this person in your life, friends now that you're not right, sleeping right. with or anything, friends now that you've had in your well, life that without this agenda. person, <laughs> yeah, actually, no, yeah. Um, without this person, you wouldn't have been able to achieve something really massive in your lives. Okay, so first of all, have a deep. <laughs> first of all, um, I have. A few people I can call friends, and mm. I have people I call acquaintances, True. some that will cross my path, and um, we don't necessarily have to be friends, but they've taught me some of the greatest lessons in life. Mm. And um, I would refer one of them, I would, I would call, I, would, I don't want to call out the name, but she's taught me a lot of things that has made me a better person today. Even though we may not be as close as we were because we were dating back then, mm. but the lessons I learned from her, I would always be grateful for the rest of my life. So I would still call her a friend because we're still in touch and I would be grateful for those lessons because yeah, without wait, that... Wait, 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 wait. So secondly, I now have people that I feel like they've been there from day zero. Mm. They've never changed. Do you understand? Like... If this is how they have been, if this had been their um, down or weakness, it's been there right from mm. day one. So I'm used to the weakness. So regardless of how they do it this time, I know it's just this guy. Mm. You get, and that's one of my friends, Kudi. And then I have another guy who's in the UK. I have another one in America. And we haven't seen in years, but the way we talk via social media and stuff like that. Like, I still feel like I'm a part of their life. So, yes, I think five friends can still be friends for five years. But the question is, how often can you communicate as five friends? Because, mm. like I said, some of us have friends that, even if we don't talk for a year, the first chat of the mm. year is mm. like, you're just mm. catching up on everything again. Mm. Like, mm. So, communication gap will definitely be there. That so, mean, do you have any friend that you've stayed in contact with constantly for five years? Not five friends, maybe one or two. Mm. And Breeze, big shout out to Breeze, man. Mm. Yes, that's somebody I would say. Maybe a lot of things I would do because I, I, I know my down moments. He was there for me. Mm. Like, and he's been there for me. Like, he never gets tired. He never says, oh, no, I, I can't do it mm. anymore. He's always, still always there. Like, Brother comes true all the time. So big shout out to you, Breeze. Mm. Yeah. All right, I'm I'm very big on friendship. Like mm. not excessive friendship. Not everybody has to be my friend, but I have really few people. If you're looking for me, if I've done anything wrong, there are few people in my life. You can just knock their doors and like, yeah, I know where it is. Mm. If you try to reach me, you can't get through to me. There's few people who can tell you mm. where I am. Well, I've, I have a friend that we've been friends for like 25 years. I have one of 20 years. I have another one of like five years. Mm. You get and. For me, but for the, the question of can five friends be <coughs> friends for five years, right? A, a lot of things will happen. Mm. A, lot mm. of, a lot of factors will come Life will happen. Mm. Life will definitely happen. You might not, the whole five might not be there forever. We're all not going to be millionaires. We're not, mm. all not going to be successful and all that. Mm. So along the line, I've had friends who actually dropped, dropped me when they start calling, guy, how far would you go in key next mm. week? How far? The contributions, I'm like, and two different times I've said, um, <laughs> you know, you guys have to go without me. Mm. Stylishly. They won't, they, won't call, they won't call me for the mm. next one. Yeah. I, don't get, I don't get offended by it. I just understand it's just like things mm. happen, right? So you, they might all not be friends. For Let me tell you the next call you make. Mm. Guys, the trip to Yankee, my private jet, they said, so now I go buy the yeah, that's, so now go buy the four. That's the vibe. You get that's me. The vibe right that's so the yes, vibe. I have few ones. I have, um, I have Anulo Akbofini, that's a guy. Mm. We've been friends for 25 years now. We went to the same primary school. We mm. met in the same 
secondary school, mm. we got to university, we met the again. Like, guy, what happened? Why did you chase mm -hmm. me for that? We live in the same neighborhood, not mm. planned. And I have someone with Dumu. Right, that's mm. been friend for 20 years also. Mm. So, yeah. We can be friends. Oh, that's awesome. I, I personally am not a big fan of cliques, of, mm. um, you know, plenty of people doing the same thing together because it's never true. There will always be either groups, subgroups in, in that group. group. Thank you. Um, and I don't like to lie to myself. I can only control the one I can control. So I like to have a direct relationship with you and have a direct relationship with you. I've noticed that when you start to bring more than two or three people, it's not the same. And then I'll not tell you something and I hope you don't tell this yeah. person because I'm not there. I'll yeah. just lie to each other. So it's very messy. If I was in that five group, it would not work because I would have removed <laughs> myself from it anyway. But um, I can't speak for clicks because I don't roll that way. But in terms of personal relationships, yeah. I've, I've been very fortunate to have really good friends. And I would say it's a fortune because I've met a lot of people and I've seen them through life, go through, um, um, do life with people that don't really have their backs. Like their quality of friends to me is very low if I compare them to the type of friends that I've had. Yeah. I've seen people who no one is there for them. Nobody um, is there for them. No one, they can't say that they have real people that tell them the truth or really be there for them. So when I see people like that, I really, I look back into my life and I'm a lot more grateful for the people that I have who call me out, help me grow, put their money where their mouth is and stuff. Mm. I've had, I think university for me was my big break in finding those real friends. Mm. Um, high school was still cool, but it's very shallow. It's very like, oh, when you're free, Instagram, dirty December, which is fine. It's always good to categorize mm. what kind of friends you have and what they're there for. There's some people that I know is just to banter about the gist of social media. There's some people that are there is for work. Some people is for fitness. Business. You know, I, I, I really like to keep my, tell myself the truth. So I have friends like mm -hmm. that but uni mm -hmm. was the first time I started to get really all-encompassing sisters and brothers and for some reason I attract men not in sexual ways but my, my close friends most of them <laughs> are actually guys and I'm grateful for them a shout out to Dayo Oyeleke aka Moi Moi everybody's off Moi Moi no everybody knows who that is um, last somebody has been there for me How about since Gary? day one <laughs> another person is Sally Fia she's a Zambian I met her in school those people have really been there for me I think using this opportunity while we're all in our feelings about the people who've been there for us if there's anything you want to say to someone right now who either hasn't really had a friend to call their own mm. do you think that there's any advice that you can give them based on the fact that you okay so have, one thing you all missed is um when i was talking about my story i called individuals like separately mm. and they say we've been five friends mm. for five years oh yeah so i've been Got friends that. with all of these guys i have personal relationship i'm not big on friends i don't really i'm not the guy that that will say that okay i'm in this person's house every weekend mm. so i have so many friends that I, i'm here i'm there i'm there i'm there but you're real so i have just a few real friends mm. but not necessarily a click thing because i don't do the click i believe in one man army thing like mm. you feel me i do my thing myself and if i ever need help i'm not too proud to call yeah. and they and i have the ones i can call and that's there for me so i think um I, i'll just let the viewers just do their thing so i'm giving them my slot zero nine zero six thousand <laughs> five seven one nine that's and give a shout out to a friend. Mm -hmm. Yes, absolutely. Please do that. Um, tea time will go on a quick break.